My dear grandniece, last time I saw you, you were 13 months old. I was bouncing you on my knee. Your mother was my brother Alfredo's favorite daughter. Such a beautiful woman. If only she had had more time. I don't know if your father told you about it, or if you even knew him and know that I'm your great uncle. But I do know one thing. You've certainly eaten my pizzas before. Everyone's been to Pizza Padrino. And that's... was me. When you read these lines, I'll have already passed on. And my empire, my life's work, was unfortunately no longer mine in the end. It fell into the hands of Don Frodato, who took over my global chain through fraud and slander. You're my last living relative, and your inheritance is small. But I bequeath to you all that I have left, the pitiful remnants of my Swiss bank account, and my very first, well, restaurant, which never became part of my chain. I've always looked after it the best I could. May it bring you more luck than it did your great uncle, Carmine Ritelli.
dear grandniece, I'm old, and I'm afraid I've actually forgotten your name over the years. If you read this, you deserve better than a doddering old great uncle, because you have decided to take over the restaurant and become the family heir. That's good. There are a few things you should know. The relationship between your father and your mother's family was difficult. I don't know what he knew about us, whether he ever contacted you, what you know about us. I don't know if you want to know, but if you do, in some of my former restaurants, in very good hiding places, you will find information. If you go that far, you deserve to know the whole family history. You'll find them if you're really passionate about pizza. That is precisely why this information is safe from that usurper. He's not investing. All he cares about is money. Your great uncle Carmine.